Hi guys from Paxarubiana, from Vienna. It's the third district. It's here the Rennweg, yeah, and the Reisner Straße. It's highly symbolic places. Here is the Russian embassy, the Serbian embassy. I call both of them for peace. It's the Shore, the Shak Shore. Yeah? He was Jean Shore. Yeah? He was the great hero of European peace. He called 1914 for the socialists yeah? uh, to uh, uh, for peace. No a la guerre, he <laughs> shouted at the Socialist Congress. I call Irendi Wagner. No a la guerre. It means no to the war. Say no to the Russian war. There is a Ukrainian protest sign outside of the Russian embassy. Very good, very good. There's a Metternich street. Yeah? We should also maybe remove that because he was also a very big warmonger against democracy. But definitely we should rename that street over there to the Nemtsov street. <laughs> that would be the sign for the Reisner Straße. Should be the Nemtsov street. Yeah? And we should remove all this connotation. You know, there is all this is in the name of the Austrian Empire and we should uh, show some humility that the time of empire is over and you have the time of the European Union and all who want like the Serbs can be part of that peaceful union but they have to say yes to peace and that's so important and no to the guerre no a la guerre I have shown you some of these uh, sites now the Rennweg very historic Metternich said here the Balkan starts so this side the Balkan here Vienna That was his Beaumont and uh, Jean Jaurès. I've shown you, I've shown you the Russian embassy. The, I didn't want to make uh, videos because there's the military there because there was a lot of protest. There's the Ukraine protest sign. They have painted it in yellow, but the city was not ready, like in Tirana, for example, to make a free Ukraine street or like in Prague, like a Nemtsov street or so, because Austria is strongly in grip of the Russian money, 26 billion, mostly in Austrian tourist resorts or mostly in Vienna. That has helped the Vienna uh, recovery very much. And uh, of course, they are all paid on by the Russians and by the Serbs. And many of the politicians are on the payroll. And that's one of the truth. So I showed you also the church. I call for a no to the basic treaty in Montenegro. I say yes to religious freedom like we have it in Austria. For all religions, we have the protected status and they have a bishop here, the Serb Orthodox, fine but no kind of uh, these extraordinary powers which they want to have. Yeah. And I call for an apology of Austria for all our colonial crimes. Yes, I will go now to Belvedere to show you that one. Absolutely. And we have to come to new understanding with Serbia, but on the basis of uh, mutual uh, understanding. Yeah. No Gavrilo Princip, no Herzendorf. Yeah. And that's the logic of that one. So good. I think it's very interesting Renwick to Jean Jure, to all the others. I think I made everything very clear here and I call for peace against uh, Russian terrorist state. We should cut our ties in Austria, cut the gas, uh, cut the imports, cut everything and also be free from Putin and the Serbs should do the same so we can live all together in harmony after Serbia has recognized Kosovo and all states in the Balkans are in NATO together with Austria. Then our long quest for peace is coming to a lasting settlement inside American European peace order, NATO, EU and the Euro. That's the future and let's work for it very fast. For peace. Thanks a lot. Bye.